Activate negativity, nine thing at a time podcast. You need to hear this. I hear news here and there sometime, and there's so many school shooting case, somebody else kids got shot case. I hear that all the time. And you're gonna always hear this, okay? When there's a children shooting or kids shootings, I don't know if you guys notice this thing, when you hear the news reporter interview the family, the moms usually start crying. They're like, oh my God, somebody shoot my uh, kid, somebody, you know, shoot my children and all that. Okay, but they say that so softly for some reason. Reason. you know you never like look if, if 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 your kid got shot okay if your kid got shot that's a really horrible thing okay give me one second listen if your kid got shot that's a horrible thing that's supposed to piss you off okay it's a really messed up thing the moms on the news they never cry like OD they'll do like a little bit of like that but they don't you don't hear them saying something like you know i hear them saying like oh my god whoever did this or uh we kind of know this has been happening it's time for us to all stop this thing and we will not gonna let that happen or if it hurts for my kids then it must be hurting for other kids to get shots for other parents it must be hard so we all as a community need to stand up and we need to fight this so bad not a regular protest but a big big type of protest but you know what you never hear these parents go hard i don't know why man but yo there's something's very weird because because let me tell you what if this is me if this would have happened to me if this would have happened to my kids you know i love babies if this would have happened if my kid if my child gets shot on a school shooting i wanna go living nuts on the rest of my life to stop any more further school shooting and before any of that i wanna first wanna fix the law that whoever on there up there they're making it easier to get this type of type of thing even happen more often you get it like that should never be happening and i don't know why these moms on the news they don't come up together and they don't make a serious like a big scene out of it because you should be because this is a baby this is the kiss that you have carried so many times this is the baby you brought them to chuck e cheese imagine if somebody took me to chuck e cheese somebody paid for my school or not somebody took me to all the fancy uh, restaurant i took me to applebee's you know family dinner this is the babies that you bring them to park with play with this is this is your soul okay and some douchebag gonna shoot my kid because somebody else have their own problems or somebody's parents treat them in a differently so they bring that anger to the school and shooting the teachers and my kid not so fast okay so i don't know what's up and if there's a lot of moms here post this video please save this video this is very important i don't know why they're not talking about this but like you know even if the news is let's just say the news editors are cu editing cutting the videos left and right you could have still make a TikTok out of it you could have still put this to all over the social media social media is the hope you see social media without any unfiltered you want to spread the message as much as possible because you know these news channels they're gonna try to edit these videos you know they're not gonna show everything on the internet you never hear as a public's mouth when somebody gets shot somebody get robbed you never hear hear the victim going crazy or going dirty on the news or talking dirty on the news they always probably cut the scene you never know but you don't worry you can also come up with the channels like that like yo we need to come up because if you're a smart mom you would be you would be kind of knowing why this is happening you know you would be automatically instead of even not pointing the finger to the police you want to find out that who's causing this thing which people are not putting an end cap out of it because it seems like that if your if your kids get shot multiple times and this is keep happening and this is not turning and this is not shutting down and this is not stopping anytime soon then there had to be some sort of profit related reason there or maybe there has had to be some sort of uh like uh, there had to be some sort of reason that exists why this is what happening for last like decade because we're living in the most modern generation so how how in the world in the most modern generation this type of thing can even happen our generation has been modernized like 10 15 years ago this is supposed to be stopped and easy to trace down like long time ago you get it so there's no way you cannot tell me it's so hard to trace it's not like bro what are you talking about about. so there's something that's gotta be wrong you parents if you got if you guys are victim of it or if you know or you think your kids could be in trouble on your neighborhood you gotta go hard you gotta go hard not as emotionally hard but you gotta be technically hard to make sure this type of act and horrible act must be banned forever like and subscribe and you want to press the heart button over okay i'm gonna be making more video about this but you want to follow my other channels as well before the tiktok get banned over peace peace on people bro